Now that API and FTP connections have been made, we can work on configuring the connector's other preferences in site configuration. Let's take a look at the other options that we can modify. We'll navigate back to the site configuration screen from the Channel Advisor workspace, and underneath the API and FTP connection settings are the additional configurations. The first two fields refer to default branches and customer classes that will be used in conjunction with the connector. All data exchanges between Channel Advisor will fall under the selected branch and customer class in Acumatica. The next item is the message queue threshold value. This value refers to when the connector will move from API to FTP data transfers. For example, if we have this set to 20, the connector will send the first 20 records via API in a sync. Then all other data sent after that in a sync will be sent via FTP. This reduces strain on servers for users and can be adjusted at any time. The next three items refer to fulfillment by Amazon orders or FBA orders. Here we can set the shipping methods, the box type, and warehouses where inventory is kept for FBA orders. Since Amazon is responsible for fulfillment, these can be set as placeholders or as predefined values that correspond to how the inventory is fulfilled by Amazon. The next field is the default order type that orders will be imported from Channel Advisor as. A good practice is to have them imported as sales orders. However, if using a custom order type, this can be selected here. You can also toggle on the import FBA orders as invoices if you'd like your FBA orders imported as such. The final item is the default tax zone for orders and customers in Acumatica for Channel Advisor orders. This can be set using the tax values from Channel Advisor or using an existing tax zone in Acumatica. If using a tax provider plugin, this can be adjusted here to add the tax provider's tax zone. We've configured the default preferences. Now we can make adjustments to marketplace specific settings. At the top of the page, click the Marketplace Settings tab. This allows us to set specific marketplace preferences that will override the default settings. To make a change to the way orders are imported for a specific marketplace, click the plus icon in the Marketplace section. Select the marketplace that you wish to add a configuration to, in this case eBay, and then enter in a brief description. If necessary, you can select a new order type that the eBay orders will be imported to Acumatica under. Additionally, you can adjust the new tax rules for this order, whether it's importing the value from Channel Advisor or using a specific tax zone. For orders from different states and countries, you can also adjust the tax zone and value preferences on a country and state basis. Simply click the plus icon under the Tax Management section and select the country and state. The tax preferences can then be configured to import from Channel Advisor or to be set to a specific tax zone, overriding the defaults for just the countries and states in this section.